So, I'm going to go all in with infantry and artillery here. I, I do like that buy. Um, right, so, we commit. I'm not going to bother putting infantry in Belarus because we can't, st we're not going to take Ukraine anyway, so I can't stop these free tanks coming in. Um, got to try and just kill everything we can. I mean, I think we're averaging, it says it average to kill, what was it? Not sure, not sure. But hopefully if we can kill, if we can get like the five infantry dead and take back less than five, that'd be nice. Let's grab this. I'm pulling all this back as well. All right, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. So we want nine hits, ideally. If we in a perfect world, we'll be getting nine hits here. Okay. Ooh, good. Very good. So seven hits, that's really good, actually. So maybe, how many are you going to get now? Four. Shit. For oh, fuck's sake. Oh, that was so... It would have been such a nice strafe as well. It would have been such a nice strafe. That's more than I wanted. Um, I can't realistically pull... Oh, that's such a shame. Such a shame. We may have lost... That was way more. We we both hit more. Than I think we we were expected there, but that's very unfortunate. We got so much back. Damn it. Um, so let's reassess the board then. Yeah, we we can't we can't hold. Yeah, I kind of regret my decision to move the fight here. The, the, the odds were dicey. I think I probably should have just played it safe, cut my losses here, and moved the fighter, the American fighter, into the Caucasus, because now we have lost these two. The good news is, in a way, if he stacks West Russia, we can, we've dead zoned it, so he can't, uh, he can't capture it. Um, or he can't capture it heavy, at least. We can, we can dead zone it, so... Uh, just a bit unfortunate. I think we, it could have been fantastic if we got, we had seven hits against the tank, which was above average. Um, I think, I think based on the calculations, but yeah, his his hit back were well above average. So that kind of sucks. We had to go forced away out. But I kind of contemplated pushing into Ukraine as well to stack that, but it just didn't make any sense because he would have just wiped out everything here completely, uh, and he would have pushed into West Russia. So I would have just been completely smothered. But here, at least we can fight back and just keep them at bay for a bit longer while we get things into position. We've got troops moving forward. Africa's almost ours, which is nice. Okay, UK2 gets the Snowden. So, yeah, very aggressive, uh, very aggressive opening here. Five tanks, well, heavy tank rush. Uh, destroyed the destroyer and cruiser. That's what I should destroy two fighters. That's the big uh, misplay from me. I should have thought about that. It's kind of annoying. Uh, lost two infantry for it, though, I guess, <laughs> in some small margin of bonus. Um, yeah, I'm pushing to Archangel. So Rush is a bit under threat, to the least. Uh, I think I can kill this, though. It's, it's only eight units. I've got ten bordering. Uh, well, technically, thirteen. And then I've got fires to support so this should die land units here should be able to kill this so if we go all in here it's a shame that we can't obviously mass it with fighters now because we, we can't land uh uk plans first obviously um anyway we've gone for one and but one and two i'm hoping india's safe i'm not character i'm not i can't be bothered <laughs> i'm just gonna risk it uh not efficient play but i'm <laughs> I'm tired, I can't be bothered. Uh, two fighters. What is nice though, we've, we've, these three fighters have been locked out of West Russia, but we've got a carrier in 17, which I can just drop them onto, or two of them at least, which is quite nice, and I can fly into Caucasus, or even West Russia, if I need to, which is good. So, we've got a bit of a landing zone that's better than the uh, Gibraltar. Okay. Um, yeah, I was thinking of just pushing this for now. Going one, two, grabbing this guy, hitting here. Um, I think we can probably, yeah, let's hit this. I need my fighters here. I'm just going to pull back the two fighters I've got just to help out um, defend India. 
move the tank forward as well. Um, could go for some, yeah, no. So I was going to try and grab Northwestern, but there's just no point suiciding a transport. I'll just hold it with the main fleet for now, we'll just regroup all together. Okay, um, that's good. I can't really do much here. Could possibly try. I'm going to try this actually just to give Russia a slightly easier ride. If we manage to kill this, we could at least just walk in there and not have to worry about it. And if we kill West Russia, which I'm planning to, it will eliminate the threat of uh, Caucasus being taken for one more round, which is good. Um, could also grab. I'm going, to, I'm going to play a risky game here. I'm going to do this as well, try and take out that infantry in Burma. That's probably a stupid move, because if I fail, it's just one for one trade, and obviously I'm getting a defender that depends on two, rather than an attacker that attacks on one, but whatever, it's fine. Let's play a risky game here. Alright, Algeria. Not great. Good return for that. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, Libya. Nice. Well, that's Africa conquered. Ukraine. I don't necessarily need to take this, I just want to kill the unit on it. One plane hit will be good. Okay. Not great. Come on. Nice. Okay, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. It dies, which is the main thing. Burma, this is a bonus. If we take this, it'd be fantastic, but if not, it's fine. Okay, let's kill the unit if we can. Oh, that's why that was risky. <laughs> I hate doing those uh, with Russia as well. Those one unit trades, because they're just so, so dangerous. Not dangerous, but it's just, you know, so common to lose that infantry, not to the territory. All right, all hands to here. We've lost an infantry defender, which is kind of crappy, but whatever. Um, definitely put you here. Probably should have thought about the placement of those guys. What can I put? Yeah, I think actually Egypt's safer. Because <laughs> we're going to move these uh, US troops very quickly. Okay, that's good. Move you here. Actually, Gibraltar's better, isn't it? I think just to get to the Caucasus. Let's do Gibraltar. One, two. Um, it's Caucasus is all Russia itself. I'm thinking Russia itself actually was cancelled that completely. Let's go to where? Uh, let's go to Iceland. Pull you forward. Oh yeah, easy to defend here, don't I? Okay. All right. So fingers crossed it doesn't go for some suicidal attack on, well, some aggressive attack on India. It's going to be nine, two, and two. It should be more than more than fine. Okay, how are we looking? One six four, one seven three. Not terrible. But yeah, we should get some some kind of profit with these. I could even to be fair, I could even blitz through. Oh, it's tempting to blitz through, but it's a bit. These are precious German uh, Russian tanks. Tempting. But yeah, we should be getting a pro good profit. I'm going to probably commit with all these uh, 10 units and try and kill everything here, hopefully. It does mean, obviously, we, if we fail to take Archangel, he's probably going to go straight for Russia because he's got 8 tanks and a fighter bordering, so. Uh, or in range, rather. So I do need to probably kill this. If I don't, I'm just going to pull back to Russia. Okay, round 2 US against Snowden. So yeah, he's done this interesting push move into Archangel, which I'm hopefully going to get some nice rolls here to kill most of this. But we'll see. Um, for now, US. So, um, don't really want, well, we, we can't do a med ship, we've got, we've got, no, we've got no ships. Uh, so I'll just pull back here, I'd pick some more guys, move these guys to 10 probably. Um, I 
Yeah, we're stretching this a bit. It's not particularly efficient. Uh, do anyway. I'm going to have to pick up some anti and this is what I'm planning here to make the uh, transports full, but it's not it's not perfect. Right, anything we can hit here? Worthwhile? Not really. Um, I will go north with these guys, I think I'll just put them to Russia for now, these two infantry, in case things go really bad. Uh, yeah. No attacks to do. Alright, let's land the planes anyway, this is nice, so we get these in India nice and early. Carrier, sub. Um, this should be safe. Yeah, it's safe. India. Okay. Yeah, we can fill those transports, but not, <laughs> not ideally. And this is not ideally as well. I don't like six infantry here, but that's fine. 